Council of Europe is the continent's leading human rights organisation. Forty-six states have signed up to the European Convention on Human Rights, a treaty designed to protect your human rights, your country's democracy and to uphold the rule of law. We defend freedom of expression and of the media, freedom of assembly, equality and the protection of national minorities. We help member states to fight corruption and terrorism. Most of all, we protect you for the future to come. No Council of Europe member state applies the death penalty. It's all about European countries choosing to come together through shared standards. So what does it mean in practice? Your rights are promoted and protected through the European Convention on Human Rights and more than 200 other international conventions. To uphold your rights, each country accepts to fulfill their commitments. The Council of Europe follows, or as we say, monitors, developments in all member states. The European Court of Human Rights makes sure that the European Convention on Human Rights is applied in all countries. The Parliamentary Assembly, composed of delegates from each member state, discusses topical issues and asks European governments to take initiatives and report back. The Assembly also elects the Secretary General, who has overall responsibility for the strategic management of the organisation. And together, all 46 member states in the Committee of Ministers discuss priorities for decisions and actions. The Committee of Ministers is the governing body of the Council of Europe. Everyday decisions in the Council of Europe are taken here by countries represented by their ambassadors. The Committee of Ministers relies on the Parliamentary Assembly for advice. The Assembly is the driving force of the Council of Europe. Through its recommendations, the Assembly demands action on behalf of the 700 million people they represent. Here, they hold debates on issues affecting Europeans. At the Congress of Local and Regional Authorities, we discuss local democracy and help to improve local governance. The Congress also monitors local and regional elections in Europe. The European Court of Human Rights oversees the implementation of the Convention in the Member States. Individuals can bring complaints of human rights violations to the Strasbourg Court once all possibilities of appeal have been exhausted in their own country. If they win their case, then the Court can sanction governments, awarding damages against the state and demanding it improves its laws and practices. The Commissioner for Human Rights is an independent institution of the Council of Europe, mandated to promote awareness of and respect for human rights. The Commissioner can comment in media and meet civil society and governments. The Commissioner provides advice and guidance on human rights in all 46 member states. We make a difference for many people through our conventions. Here are some of them.
In order to create a better world, we need to talk and to listen to each other. The Council of Europe is a place where opinions and values are shared and exchanged. Communication is understanding. Understanding is respect. Respect is human rights. Human rights is democracy. And democracy is the rule of law. We are the guardians of human rights, democracy and the rule of law.